Hi guys, my name is Kylene Segovia Vasquez. I'm Julia Szymanski. And I'm Andrea Rosas. And we will now play a compilation video of our hydroponics classes systems. Hi, I'm Anthony Zeno. I'm Drummer Kambani. I'm Karina Toledo. I'm Julia Szymanski. And I'm Abdullah Nasir. Our system was based on the zipper design. We obtained two fence posts which we suspended from ivy pole. The posts were cut out and filled with large rock wall blocks which housed our plants. The plants were fed by feeder tubing that inserted directly into the rock wall cube. Our design required two pumps and two separate buckets for reservoirs. The fence post caps were used at the bottom to collect water and to help it drain. Hi, my name is Joseph Valentino. I'm Samuel Andrews. I'm Delilah Torres. I'm William LeBron. Our project was designed as a vertical NFT system. We utilized two two-inch PVC pipe sections with circular holes to support our plants. They were attached to a center support by means of a T-shaped connector and two neck degree angle connectors. The system was anchored to a 20-gallon garbage can and supported internally by a, a small inverted garbage can. Hello, my name is Dulce Amonte. My name is Marcus Shredia. I'm Mario Vergara. I'm Nelly Pacheco. I'm Abigail Melendez. Our project utilized an upper reservoir that housed six planters. These plants are contain a large wall cube block with a smaller wall cube cube in the center. The larger rock wall cubes were fed directly using feeder tubes attached to a flexible hose. Our greatest challenge was the appearance of several leaks in the system that we repaired with silicone. Overall, our system was successful in the growth of plants. Hello, my name is Christian Montanez. I'm Darren Lattel. I'm Candida Rodriguez. And I'm Kylene Segovia. Our project was based on a modified NFT system. We utilized four Fiji water bottles attached side by side with Velcro to a storage lid. It rested on a plastic fish tank. And the plants were watered and utilizing feeder tubing attached to a flexible hose. Hello, my name is Fahad Mahmoud. I'm Carly Sahiba. I'm Corley Camille. I'm Don C. Smith. Our system was based on an ebb and flow design that utilized simple and widely available materials. The growing bed which housed our plants was made from milk crates covered by a black garbage bag. The plants were placed in cut plastic bottles filled with lava rocks. The milk crate was, pl was placed in a round reservoir and elevated by larger plants. Hello, I'm Oswaldo Morales. Andrew Gilmet. Maria Montes. Jessica Gonzalez. Our project was based on a modified tower designed to resemble a tree structure. The center of our system was supported by a 2-inch PVC pipe. The plants were placed in cutout sections of 3-inch PVC and fed with flexible tubing. Our greatest challenge was trying to run the tubing inside the pipe, which proved to be impossible. It was necessary to run tubing on the outside and use wire ties to secure it. Our design proved to be somewhat complicated, but it provided a great opportunity for teamwork and original thought. Hi, I'm Andrea Rosas. Hi, I'm Rudy Torres. I'm Savannah Cordero. And I'm Alvin Fong. Our project was based on a simple vertical design that could be easily assembled with widely available materials. This system could be adapted to function efficiently in a kitchen window. We obtained one liter bottles and attached them in a vertical fashion to an IV pole. Tubing was run on the outside of the system and emitter nipples were attached to deliver water to the plants. The bottles were filled with lava rocks that held our plants. County Prep High School in Jersey City, New Jersey, part of the Hudson County Schools of Technology. So we would like to acknowledge our superintendent, Mr. Frank Argiulo, mm -hmm. our principal, um, Barbara Mendola, and our teachers, Mr. Nicholas Lavolpe and Dr. Stephanie Szymanski. This experience provided a unique opportunity to plan, design, and implement an original structure that would work efficiently in the growth of plants. This challenge blended creativity, teamwork, and trial and error methods to bring our project to fruition. We would like to thank New York Sunworks for allowing us to participate at this conference. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Thank you.